Hello everybody, I am the 8-Bit Gent, and today we are playing Blank Frame. So without further ado, let's get into this. <laughs> oh, we're off, baby. <laughs> uh, are, are we in? Are we doing it? Okie dokie. Henry, what in the world was that sound? It scared the hell out of me. I think it came from the hallway. Should investigate. Wise decision, Henry. Hello? Ah, I see you. I'm the creep. So, what you got going on over here? Some nice books? My computer. That is what it is. It's busted. I've been trying to save up for a new one. Yeah, me too. Gotta say, it feels real weird when I can't mess around with it. Almost makes uh, you want to go out and do something. Like, what? Almost. Well, let's just uh, save up our money. A bag of chips. Some tissues conveniently placed right at your computer desk. Film poster. Poster for maximum pain. I actually prefer the sequel, but I couldn't find any posters for it. Alright. Neato burrito. Bed. My alarm clock. My arch enemy. Yeah, mine too. Started sleeping at 3 p.m. Probably would have woken up around this time anyway. My sleeping schedule has been a real mess lately. I've been trying to fix it, but... But what? Don't leave me off on a cliffhanger there. An eraser! I have no use for this right now. No, you can always use an eraser. Sign. Oh, it's right here. So empty. We sure could use an ad here. If you want this spot, contact us at adsonus.com forward slash contact. 202-555-0800. Blank sign for advertisements. Only number zero is clearly visible of the phone number. I don't know, I made out a couple of them. Okay, let's investigate. To the hallway. Looking around. What do you see, Henry? The hell is that? A cabinet? The rusted cabinet in our hallway. Oh, they said the thing. Blank frame. You seem pretty intrigued with this. The block. What in the hell? <laughs> Nope, it wouldn't budge. Why is it so damn heavy? Can't open the doors either. Okay, well, I gotta figure something out. I'm sure we will, Henry. You and me both. We got this. How advertisement lease splits? None of them interesting, as usual. Hmm. If someone comes by and drops a leaflet, could I ask the person for help? Doesn't sound so appealing, though. Sitting in front of the door for hours. No, it does not. It's of no use. The building's phone lines are not working at the moment. Last night's storm is to blame. It all feels like a bad dream. Okay, Henry, whatever you say. This is where we came out of? It's like half in front of the door. How'd you get the door open? Unless... Wait, did we come out of this one? Ah, we came out of that one. Can we go in this one? Can't open the bathroom door. Need to move it. There could be something in there that's helpful for the situation. If not, well, I still need to access the bathroom at some point anyway. I thought that said bedroom, not bathroom. 
All right. What's that racket? Open the curtains. What's that noise? It needs to be coming from outside. Let's see. Ah, it's a mysterious paper. What's this? Wind is blowing some paper against the window. It says, Nursing walls have grown tired. Dormant lungs need their cleansing before the night vacates them completely. Winds of vastness are waiting to, with open arms. Opening an eye and an ear to the world is the first step. I don't know what this is. Yeah, me neither. Best to leave it. DVDs? What you got hanging out over here? Some DVDs I've bought. I used to watch a lot of comedy and action films back in the day. But in recent years, my taste has shifted to darker films like horror and thrillers. And television my dad made me back when I moved out. It killed some time watching something. Wait, where's the remote? Eh, probably some, just some rom-coms on anyways. Can't relate to those. Still, probably should find that remote. Eh, alright, well, we'll take a look for it. After we see what you were reading. Dim River News. I actually hate, the, uh, I hate reading the news as they usually just piss me off. But I read some every now and then. But I read some every now and then. Ooh. Get a zoom in. I just, uh. I'm gonna do something with this. Oh, okay. There's some headlines. The young are starting to drift away from society. The officials consider blocking Tur Turso Cave. The perpetrators of last autumn's series of rapes are yet to be found. We better find them. I have a feeling they might show up. The apartment key. Let's take that. Two dollars. You didn't even take the sticker off, man. Picture frame with the default. Oh, with the pic default picture still in it. Two dollar tag still on it. You got another blank one here. What do you got to say about that? Nothing. Just as I thought. The kitchen knife. What's uh? Can I? Can I? I can't interact with that. Oh, there we go. I have no use for this right now. You never know. I say take it. What you doing down there? Hello, friends. Too good. The radio. It's my radio. Got it from mom. No antenna attached, though. They could listen to some radio, I guess. I have to find the antenna first. Man, you are just missing everything. Open beer. Been drinking a lot more lately. Beer and energy drinks. Yeah, not very healthy. But ironically, they keep me going. I feel you there, buddy. I'm with you on that one. Let's open the fridge. I'm not that hungry. What if you're thirsty for another beer? I got nothing to eat right now anyway. Which could become a problem at some point. Look at the night sky. Nights like these give me kind of an excited feeling. Like I want to go run around in the woods. But I never do. Well, now I can't. Yeah, it doesn't look like you're too close to too many woods, Henry. George could contain something helpful. Ah, it's locked. Ah, now I remember. I lost the key a couple days ago. Forgot to ask for a new one from the landlady. Great. Henry, you're just all... You're just full of it. All right, let's go check the bedroom. See if there's anything good in here. Hey, I found the antenna. He was in the bedroom the whole time. <laughs> gotta get this. Gotta get this uh, radio on. Hurry, quick! <laughs> Click. Ah. Uh. 
Thank God. What a horrible noise. That was some weird radio station. All that racket must have woken up my neighbors. Well, good. Then they can help come help me. Huh? Someone's banging on the door. Guess it's a neighbor. Well, here we go. Hello? It, yes, hello. The hell are you doing in there? What music is that horror noise supposed to be? People are trying to sleep for God's sakes. Miss Rita, I'm sorry. Uh, I, it, it's just, uh, but hey, I need your help. What? You need what? Help, I need help. I can't get out. What? Open the door. I can't hear you, boy. I can't. It's blocked. The ceiling. Just keep it down, party boy. I'm tired as hell. I don't have time for this nonsense. No, please. Help, Miss Rita. Help. I can't believe I'm in this situation. I gotta start thinking how the hell I'm gonna get out of here. Find a way to get this out of the way. Need to open it somehow. Need to move it somehow. Well, maybe if we make the neighbors angry enough. And that was Just Another Night by Bowie Jack. Let me tell you, this night is getting wilder and wilder by the minute. As Friday nights always do here in DRFM. As you know, we're broadcasting from the town center, right in the heart of the action. Yes, even though we just played a rather slow and melancholic folk piece, the heat of the night is burning us up. I'm Richie, and this is, once again, DRFM, keeping the grim from the dim. Stay on frequency, and we'll try to stay by that radio. Don't go jumping the river just yet. Actually, don't go jumping in that river, period. The officials don't like that one bit. I know, I know. Everyone loves to go crazy on these summer weekend nights. But people have drowned. Sorry to ruin your buzz. You know, I have a bit of a story about the river of ours, but before that, here's a few words from our sponsors. Stay tuned. Yeah, we'll leave it on. Let's get the knife. You still have no use for it. Hey. That girl that was, like, drinking or throwing up over here is gone. Climb down from here? Why, I, I think that's a terrible idea. You're, like, on what? Like, the third floor, I think? Yeah, about the third floor. Yeah, too risky. There's gotta be another way. Alright, screw it. We're trying to jump. Hmm. Well, I don't know. I could probably land on some trash, but best of all, it's not that visible, so it's not as awkward. Well, I need to put some sheets together, slide down, get some help. Simple. Take the bed sheets. All right. Look down. Huh? Too short. Not enough. Whew. Not good with heights. Not sure I can do this after all. How much for my shrouded escape? There's a girl there staring at me. I think this is the girl that was staring at us before. Out the front window. She was just standing by that street light, just watching. Hmm. Feels weird to ignore her. Might as well ask her for help. Hey! You hear me? You, uh... You wanna help me? What? I said you wanna help me. What are you doing, creep? What? What are you doing? Uh, are you robbing someone's home? What? No! What are you doing with those bed sheets? You want people to know what your bed sheets look like? That's disgusting. Is this some kind of fetish? What? I don't... Get away! That's what I'm trying to do! Well, jeez, thanks for the help. Oh, wait. You throw... Yeah! Ooh! Was oh, that knocked us out? Ooh, 
Shit was going down across the way. Damn, what the hell? What's up with that? Well, that was embarrassing. Hey, but you got a plastic bottle. Thank God it was only a plastic bottle. Man, she just spare me. Reeks of strong alcohol. She must have been drunk as hell. Good throw, though. Especially for a drunken girl. Hmm. This could be of some use. If I cut a piece of the plastic with something... Screw this sheet escape plan for now. I'm gonna fix this situation. Need to cut up... I, you won't pick it... All right, well, I can, we gotta go get that knife. Get the knife. Get the knife. Ah, come here, you. Making progress. All right. You could have just brought the bottle to you, but... All right, here you go. Oh, we gotta equip the knife. That's right. Use the kitchen knife. Oh, did you cut yourself? You did, didn't you? You dingus. Damn it, Henry. Can't take you anywhere. Did you just throw it outside the window? Your little kid is going to come by and pick that up. Damn it. Cut myself. <sighs> Seems like it's nothing serious. Guess I'll buy a new knife. Whenever it is that I get out of here. Starting to be on edge. It's getting to me more than it should. I'm going to get out. Not like I'm in a hurry anyway. At least I got the piece. Starting to think this is a dumb idea though. I don't know what your idea is yet. And I don't know why you chuck the knife out the window. We could have very easily used that. It's a piece of plastic I cut from the bottle. I heard you could use it to open a locked door. Oh, I see your plan now. Now it's possible to open a door like this with a piece of plastic. Give us a try. Okay, I think I got it. I didn't get humiliated for nothing. Yes! Way to go, Henry. I believed in you the whole time, I swear. Hey, look at us. We're in the closet. Open. You got a hammer and a chisel. That seems important. You have no use for this right now. Hang in there. I'm trying. Uh, you got, a, what is that? Like a toolbox or something? Boxes. I haven't cleaned this place up for a long while. I mainly dumped all the useless stuff in this room. I should see if there's anything useful behind these boxes. What are you going to find, Henry? Huh? What's this? It's a hole. I've never noticed this before. There's a light shining through it. From the hallway? Oh yeah, looks like it. That's Miss Meadows, my next door neighbor. I get nervous if I walk past her in the hallway. Guess I have a bit of a crush on her. Don't know anything about her though. Jesus, she scares me with those gorgeous green eyes. What is that? The peculiar graffiti behind the gate. I've seen these before. In the streets. Nothing else, eh? You should, you should call on Miss Meadows and ask for help. I guess that's it for the hole, eh? We got a mop. My mop. Could prove useful. Well, let's... Let's take it. Oh, it made a, it made a noise. Uh... Alright, let's head out. What are we going to do with the mop? Can we rock it? Use mop. Oh, we can. Come on. Shimmy. Shimmy. Use those muscles. Christ, that's really heavy. I managed to move it just enough, and then it stopped moving altogether. But now it's blocking the front door even more. I can get into the bathroom now. Perfect. That's all I wanted. We need to find that TV remote. 
you take it into the bathroom with you. Dental floss. 100 meters worth of floss. I could think of some I could think of some use for this. Well, let's take it. Can be combined with something. Ooh, okay, so I need something else. We'll come back for you. Can't pick you up right now anyways. I got a squeegee. What is that? Is that a bathroom? What? Window. Shower. And a weird your shower and uh, bathroom. It's all just kind of like one room. Uh, you don't have like a tub or anything. All right, let's look out the window. Nope. Boat's not in there. Are you serious? Why? Why and how did the remote get here? And why would you have ever put it here? Were you like fucking with the neighbors and like turning the TVs on and off from over in your bathroom while you were bored taking a dump? This is my TV remote. What's it doing here? That's what I want to know. Well, got my the remote. Ooh, let's, let's creep some more. What's he watching in there? This guy makes me sick. Is this what the guy does all night, every night? What? Watch TV? Or... Porn Caesar? Hmm. Something tells me turning the TV on will, uh... Move the plot forward. Let's check on, uh, Miss Meadows as well. I don't think we're a creep. We sure do look in a lot of people's windows. Hey, there she is. What's she watching? Looks like she's watching some sort of horror flick. Okay, I'm bored. Let's turn on our own telly. We have the power. All right, got the remote. I can now look what's on TV. Thank goodness. Hank, what happened last summer? It's all right, Eva. I was out of town. I don't blame you at all, but I blame myself. I have loved you ever since I first saw you in class. Oh, Eva. I can't help but think I've ruined something beautiful. Eva, please. You make me feel special. Well, you are a special girl. Hank, let's run away. Keep riding buses until we forget the name of this town. I can't just leave again. You're not leaving. We're leaving. Oh, e Yeah, screw this. What else is on? Ah, my favorite channel. One. The Void. Hope is still discernible ahead, but mockingly so after years of Void. The Pit's overgrowth. Something stains the path. Corruption. Corruption stains the path. Hope. Void. Corruption. The Holy Trinity. Oh. Now I'm interested. Uh-huh. Oh. It's a cosmos! I love this show. Uh-huh. Yep. Oh, there's more. All right. It's the moon! The moon! Paper, would you shut up? You are ruining the mood of this TV show. City... Put... City... City pools? 24-7? Yeah, that got old. All right, the static. And... Hello. Hi again. Goodbye. Okay. Oh, great. The sheets fell down. Seems like the knot was too loose. Well, I'm glad I didn't start climbing down with that. You can't seem to tie a knot to save my life. I had to learn that stuff at some point. Not to save my life, then. I'm being dramatic. I'm gonna make it. I'm just stuck for a while. Did 
Hello? Hi, person. You hear that? What's that weird sound? It seems to come from the toilet. The water's gone. Should I flush? Screw it. Flush it. Yes. Arise. Arise. It's okay. You have a drain that's like right here. Is it foamy? Well, hello. A wet magazine. What the? It's uh, some kind of magazine. I don't feel like picking it up with bare hands. I need something to get it from there. Ah, yes, the paper towels. This could work, but I think I have something better in the bedroom. Do you? Do you, Henry? All right, let's go. What you got in here that's better? Tissues? A napkin box. So that's what that is. This is what I have. This is what I use when I clean my keyboard. Anyway, this should be helpful. Take. Well, what is going on in there? Not my business. To the bathroom. What is that? A leaflet. It's a leaflet. What's this about? It says, Tired of waiting for someone who's meant just for you? Your odds of finding him or her widen more than you could even, or you could imagine at? Blah, blah, blah. Don't be left waiting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do people actually use those sites? No, probably not. Let's a go. Equip the napkins. Use. All right, all right. Let's take out this magazine and have a look. Eh, this is nasty. Yeah, I wouldn't be. I'd be going right in the trash. But you're you, Henry, and I'm me. So you're going to look at it and read through it. This is, uh, what am I doing? Should I open it? Yes. Oh, it's an erotic magazine. All right, look at that. Ada, ada, ada. The partly torn magazine. Most pages are stuck together. Number six is peeking from the next page. Is it? Where is number six? Oh, there it is. What is that supposed to mean? Okay, to the TV. We're going to put in all the numbers that we do know. Twas, uh, zero, six, and two. Hey, we did it. <gasps> Nothing's happening. Green's just blank. Broken? Huh. Knock. The hell? What is this? There's some writing on here, on the wall behind my TV. It says, knock. Someone knocked back. Wait, so that's... Hello, friend. Meadows. She's looking at me weirdly. Oh, I should open up my window. Hold on, hold on. 
Open window. Oh, thank God that paper's gone. Damn, window is stuck. I can open it just a bit. Lips. What's wrong? Sorry, can't open the window all the way. It's stuck or something. Okay. So, what are you doing? Why are you knocking? Uh, I just... I... Oh, you're just creepy. I need help. Yeah? No, I'm... I'm stuck. What? Yeah, the window's stuck. You already told me. You gotta speak up a bit. No, I mean, I'm stuck here in my apartment. Um, okay. You me How do you mean? The door is blocked. Something crashed through my ceiling. Oh god, are you okay? Yeah, it's just blocking the door. I can't leave. The thing won't move out of the way. Okay, um... You don't have a fo- Oh yeah, they're not working right now. What timing? Hmm. Tell me about it. So, you can't wait until to- uh, uh, So you can't wait until morning. I'm sure things are going to work out real fast then. Well, I don't know. I've thought about it too, but... I can't get any sleep, and something weird is going on here. Sorry to bother you. I'm going to try and... No, I can help you. I got nothing else to do anyway. Just gotta think of something. Um... Well, how about... Hmm... Well, I think we should introduce ourselves first. I'm Ava. Ava Meadows. Yeah, I'm Henry. Henry Jeffries. Nice to meet you, Henry. Yeah, you too, Ava. Okay, now. Should I try to push your door or something? To push, uh, whatever barrier that's in front of the door? I can't unlock the door, even. But hey, I could slide the key under the door and you could open it from the outside. Then try to push it. Okay, sure, let's try it. I'll wait by your door. I was some... Man, we got nice neighbors. Oh, let's go ahead and get that equipped. I'm sure we're gonna need it. And... You hear yet? Uh, use apartment key. Hello, here's the key. Yeah, okay, let's give us a try. I'm gonna push now. Go ahead. Come on, baby, push! Use that muscle. Well, did it move out of the way enough? Not even a bit. What? I said not even a bit. No, I heard you. It's just that... Man, I pushed really hard. Yeah, it's fine. Gotta figure something else. Okay, um... I wonder if... Should I go around and ask for help in the building? Oh, um... Uh, I don't know. I don't want to bother anyone at this time of night. I already pissed off one of my neighbors. Well, you didn't mind bothering me. That's different. There was... Uh-huh. Anyway. I think it's understandable to bother people. You need, you need help. Yeah, I know, but I'm sure I can figure out something. If not soon, then by morning when people start waking up. Okay, you still want my help? Well, I don't know what you could do for me. Oh, I have an idea. Oh? Come back to the window. Okay. Okie dokie, I'm waiting. Um, yes? You climb down to the street with bed sheets. You know, like in a prison movie or something. Oh, I already tried that. It didn't really work out. What happened? I'll just say it's been a crazy night. Lost my sheets and got hit in the face with the bottle. And that's the least crazy stuff. You're not trying it again? No, I'd rather not. Oh. How desperate are you about escaping that room? What do you mean? I mean, if you really... Uh, whatever. Maybe you're right about just waiting until morning. Yeah, yeah, I'm sorry to bother you. Bye. Thanks for helping. Hmm. Top girls, go top left. Fall into lowly, hidden realm of pleasure. Hot girls go what? Hmm. Oh, I wonder if we can use the eraser now. Maybe we can do something with that. 
these weren't closed before, were they? Excuse me? What's going on? The curtains are sewn shut. Yeah, I know. Creepy man across the way is gone, too. Can't take the eraser. Oh. Excuse me. What was that racket? Our picture fell down. All in frame. Damn. My picture frame. Guess a gust of wind came through the open window. Pick it back up. What the? Another one? Where did this come from? Broken glass. Well, I guess I should make some use of this mess. This piece is pretty sharp. Mysterious paper. What does it say? The night is long and powerful. Reliance on a stranger is vital and the forgotten sign of trust. Brings the two back together. As delight, emptiness is already lesser. Kind of weird. Eva is at her desk. I forgot to ask for my keys back. It's going to be awkward, but I'm... This is going to be awkward, but I'm going to need her attention again. Alright, well, let's, uh... Can we knock? We can't. Knock, knock, knock. I guess she doesn't hear my knocking now. How could I get her attention? Hmm. We could throw something at her. Stone curtains. I... Yeah, cut them open. Yeah. Ooh, look at him. He's putting the moves on her. Take that eraser. Yeah, creepy man is gone. That person staring out the window over there is also gone. And the creep over there. Maybe we can throw... Oh, we're out here. Okay. Maybe we can throw the eraser. Just a simple eraser on its own is pretty useless. On its own? What do you want? Oh, I wonder if I can use the floss. It... Oh. Um. Excuse me? The hell was that just now? Okay, it made it. Aha! I combined the eraser with some dental floss. I can now throw it at the window to get the atten to get attention. It shouldn't damage the window. No, it should not. Good plan, Henry. You're smart. More intelligent than I could ever be. Okay, let's see. Ah, nice throw. Scared the crap out of me. What are you doing? Oh yeah, sorry. I just wanted to, uh... Yes? You still got my keys. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Sorry. I'll slide them under your door. Just a sec. Hold on. Huh? So I also got another idea. Yeah? If you want to help me anymore, that is. Oh, sure. I was bored anyway. What are you planning? You know that phone booth between our building and the bar? Of course, I can see it from here. You want to try that phone? Oh, now you're ready to bother people, huh? Yeah, things are starting to get to me. 
I'll go. I'll be down in a minute or so. Be careful. Something weird is going on tonight. What? Lincoln Street Junkies? No, it's... I don't know. So quiet now, huh? Much nicer to talk without needing to yell, you know? Yeah, throat was getting kind of sore. Still, kind of weird talking like this. I talk to my neighbors like this all the time. Really? No, silly. You don't get out much, do you? Well, there's not much out there for me. You're the quiet type. I do go for a walk every now and then. At night. In the woods. You're just a weirdo, aren't you? A lot of times, yes. Well, that's fine. I'm a bit of a weirdo myself. How come? I like to explore abandoned places and take pictures. You like going to those kind of places? Oh yeah. And the woods too, like you. Except, I tend to go deeper. How do you know how deep I go? Ever been to the log cabins? Those ancient things? Never. Yeah, they weren't anything special. I once asked my grandpa about them, or grandma about them, and she said they'd been there before her time. And that they were used by some stay away from dream seer or dim eyes. Or something, I can't remember. Well, guess I'm going now. It'll be a minute or so. Yeah, okay, thanks. All right. What do now? Television. Guess I'm not watching TV anymore. No, I guess not. Dropped it. The hell was that? Was that Ava? It came from the alley. He said, alley. Back to the bedroom. The other one's a street. Look down. She seems startled, but I don't see a threat. Oh. I don't either. Oh, there we go. Ava, what's wrong? Oh my god, Henry. Oh my god. What? What? Ugh. There's been a murder or something. W what is it? It's literally a bloody knife. Oh, a kitchen knife? Yeah, how do you know? Uh, yeah, don't worry about that. It's nothing. What? You what? How, how did you... No, whatever you're thinking, it's much dumber. What? I didn't kill anyone. I cut myself. Oh, Henry, I didn't... I didn't know you do that kind of stuff. No, not intentionally. It was an accident, all right? Just just get to the phone. Uh, okay, I'll do that. She's really taking it slow, isn't she? Come on. Those feet moving. I don't got all night. It's already like midnight already, I'm sure. All right, what's the status? Phone doesn't work. Of course it doesn't. Why would it work? Somebody smashed it or something. Any ideas? There's a bar. Maybe I should ask for a phone? Hold on, let me look around and see if there's some other place. Okay, but please be fast. There's something weird going on. I don't see anyone here in the streets. I'll be quick, just wait. Oh god, we're gonna get this poor girl killed. Oh, it is quiet. Look outside. Rick's Grill. I've actually been there. They definitely have a phone, and they should still be open. So that's the one. We have our plan. Ah. Ava! Are you still alive? Okay, cool. It looks like she's still there. Speak! Hey! There's a place. Go to the grill. Oh, okay. I'll be back soon. All right. I should go look around the kitchen. I should go look from the kitchen window. Good plan. Keep an eye on her. I can't look this time. Oh, cool. She's already in there. I seen her. What's that? Night sky. 
night sky is like an understanding friend. At night, I feel normal. Yeah, me too. I'm a little bit of a night owl. Henry, me and you are a lot of alike. Except you're kind of a dingus. I'm extremely intelligent. Oh, it's taking her so long. I don't like this. Hope she's all right. It's a strange night. Why do I let her go outside? It's not safe out there. We just slept through this. Oh. Uh. Hiroki. Gonna. Wait for Ava. Uh. One in the morning now. Pretend there wasn't just a person with scissor legs standing in the doorway. I have a call coming in, and it's, uh, Mike. How are you doing, Mike? Hey, Richie, I'm doing good. So what's up? You got a song request or a question? No, no, none of that. I just, uh... I want to share an experience I just had on a night walk just recently. Oh, all right. Where were you walking? The center? The woods? Oh, the center. Yeah, things have gone pretty quiet around here. You don't get spooked at this hour of night in the streets. No, well, sometimes. I'm a bit of a night owl. I love the calmness. This time, though, I saw something kind of weird. I'm definitely a bit of a night owl myself, but, uh, yeah, what did you see, boy? Something about this night. It's just one of those nights. The air is kind of wet and heavy, you know, and the river is fogging up in the area, so... I'm not even sure I saw it in the way I... Yep, I know what you mean. This night kind of has a dreamlike quality to it. Anyway, Mike, tell us already. What did you see? Some kind of monster, huh? Well, it's weird. I walked by this alley and I thought I saw some person. Dressed weird and staring at me. Right beneath the only light post that isn't working. Okay, creepy. Dressed weird. Describe him to me. Not a he. She, I'm pretty sure. I don't know. She was just wearing whatever she was wearing wrong. Okay. So, I thought she was drunk or something. Yeah, there's been some partying going on just a couple of hours ago. I yelled out, you help, right? Right. And she just started walking Weird, man. Like, something about it. Maybe it was drugs instead. But then she started running toward me, and I just freaked out and ran away from her. Oh, damn. As I'm running away from her, I took one glance behind me. You were in better lighting, and I could have sworn it was... You know what? I don't know why I called. This was stupid. I gotta sleep. Gotta wake up early anyway. No, no, Mike. Uh, what did you... Ah, uh, damn. Well, that gave me the spooks. Soon it's about time for me to wrap up, so I didn't want to hear... Soon it's about time for me to wrap up, so I didn't want to hear that just as I'm about to go home. Definitely not walking home tonight. He. <laughs> well, there was no song request, so let's check... Well, there was no song request, so let's just play this beautiful piece by Lady Valen. Enjoy and stay on frequency. This is DRFM. He has to numb me more. Maybe I need something stronger. I don't want to think. All right, let's check the bedroom. Hmm. Anything new in here? Don't see anything strange here. Feels like forever that I've been waiting for. Her. The time, anyway. Well, last I checked, it was 1 o'clock in the morning. It is... Midnight. I swear it was 1 before. Zoo, do... Do a rewind. Confirm that I'm either insane or I just... Read the clock wrong. Either is possible. Still have no use for that. We could make this hole bigger. What's this? There's a clock hand inside the hole? Is that blood? 
Uh, looks like it. They are. Clock feet. That's unsettling. Take the clock hand. I peek back out. Gonna be closer? Nope, you're still there. Okay, good. It's the claw it's the it's the hour hand of my clock. It was shoved inside the hole in the wall. Oh, so I wasn't crazy. It's just missing a hand now. Alright, let's get this back in order. My clock is missing the hour hand. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to put it on. Something tells me it's not 6 o'clock. We have to figure out what time it is. She has a clock. Like what? Like 2 o'clock? Oh, we can look at it. 2 a.m. according to Ava's clock. Yep. All right, let's set this bad boy. Man, time flies. All right, let's, uh, perfect. And pretty damn close. Huh? Did I do it? That is, um, not a good sign. Not a good sign for Ava. Is there someone in our window? Oh, it's Ava. You don't look so good, Ava. Ava? Ava? Ava is... is... Is everything all right? It's Henry. Henry. Ava, is something wrong? Something wrong? It's dark in there. I thought your apartment was empty. Empty. Where did you come... When did you come back up here? Up here. You don't seem the same as before. Same as before. Why are you repeating? Repeating. Ugh. This is useless. Useless. Looks like there's something here. Red liquid. Some red liquid is dripping from the cabinet. It couldn't be. I mean, it's probably not. Still there, Ava. Look normal now. Hey! Did you just come back up? Yeah, just now. Why? You... I thought you already came. What? Please don't try to scare me now. So, what took you so long? Sorry, I fell asleep at the grill. I didn't see a phone when I stepped in. Yeah, you have to ask for it. I was waiting for someone to show up at the counter. I don't know how long I was there, but when I woke up, there was still no one. So I just left. Sorry, Henry. I could go to some other place. No, no, it's, it's fine. Let's just forget about that phone. Streets are totally empty. It's like a ghost town. Well, it's Dim River. True. Speaking of vacant places, didn't you say the... Th didn't you say the thing, whatever it is... Didn't you say the thing, whatever it is, that's blocking your door? It crashed through your ceiling? Yeah, some big old rusty cabinet or something. What about it? The fourth floor is vacant. The entire fourth floor? I've been wondering why I don't hear a peep from up there. Thought it was just some loner. Well, I did hear something tonight. Probably the landlady or something. Anyway, you must have seen how they've even blocked the stairs with that gate. Yeah, I figured it was just for construction work. No, they've just left that place be. Wonder why it's still empty. I think the Lincoln Junkies did something up there. Really? They've been in this building? Ha! They're everywhere, man. Looking for some good spots to... Take drugs, I assume, and probably ruin the place in the process with their weird... whatever, rituals? 
I don't know. But the place excites me. Oh yeah? Didn't you say you were a photographer or something? I'm a florist. Taking pictures is just a hobby. I'm a total amateur. Could you take a picture of the apartment? The apartment above you? From here? Yeah, I'm curious what it looks like. Okay, you won't see much. I know. Alright, let me get my camera. Ooh. Alright, let's see. It's kind of weird. Sure is. Come on, Ava. You can do it. She gonna jump? Oh no, she's just bending down to take a better photo. <laughs> Got it? Hmm. Also blue curtains. What? Smile. Cute. Okay. I'll go slide the photo under your door. Yeah. Right into the puddle of blood. Did you just take a picture of me? Hmm. It's quite strange indeed. She might like you, Henry. Isn't it odd? It's taking her so long. Dude, it's been like two minutes. Dude, it's been like two seconds. I should check the hallway. Oh, yeah. The hole! The glory hole! Go of me. What's this, huh? You creep around spying on your neighbors? No, I, we, young girl like you, you like that? Come to my room, miss. Old man needs some company. Get away from me, you dirty. Come on, girly. Just for a while. I'm lonely. Won't take too much of your time. Disgusting. Get off of me. Somebody help. Quiet, girl. Everybody's sleeping. Oh, shit. Ah. Uh... Uh, I gotta help Ava. Think, think. Need to distract Ina somehow. Oh, I know, I know, I know, I know. Can we, t can we take this? I have no use for this dude. You could be blowing a hole through the wall. That's something that makes a loud sound. And it needs to come from, and it needs to come from Ina's place. He lives right next to me. I guess we could throw the magazine. What about the alarm clock? Hmm. Combine this with the floss I have. Set the alarm, swing it through Ina's window. Yes. All right, here we go. When I have to swing this blind, always wanted to throw my alarm clock out the window. Even better if it goes through some asshole's window. That should do it. I should now go check if it caught his attention. Hurry. I hope this works. I could pour you a drink at my place, Missy. Don't you get it? I'm not interested. Wait, what's that sound? Seems to come from your apartment, old man. Those damn junkies. And get out of here, you fucking little freak. Mask girl is having quite a night, thanks to us. Polaroid picture. Maybe it slid the picture. Let's see. Okay. What? Did she give me the wrong photo? But where's she taking this? It's not my apartment. And it can't be the above it can't be the above one either because the point of view doesn't match the Huh. Whatever. It wasn't really worth the hassle anyhow. Well, it was worth a try. Thanks, Ava. Talk. Was that you who made that sound? Yeah, sorry it took so long. 
You all right? Uh, yeah, yeah. It's just, wow. How did you do it? It's pretty easy. There might have been a better way to do it, but... Well, it worked great. Thanks for saving me, I guess. Anyway, about the picture. I'm sorry, could I just take a minute? Before we do anything else? That whole thing was uncomfortable. Yeah, yeah, sure. You think we should just sleep through this? Pretty late. I could use a bit of rest, but this doesn't seem to go anywhere. For... This doesn't seem to go anywhere anyway. Let's get back to it later. Yeah. All right. Oh, the sad music starts playing. Why? Well, there goes her lights. The dog said goodnight. Thank you, puppy. Well, I guess it's about time I try to get some sleep. I am pretty tired. Hope she's all right. Probably hates me for making her do all that stuff for me. I always screw everything up. Nothing ever changes. Go to bed? Ah! Yes. Let's, let's just sleep it off. I have a feeling something terrible is going to happen because we said yes. Oh, the eyes are morphing. I don't know what that means. Hey, the phone's working. What the hell? Is that a phone ringing? That's... Have they fixed the lines? I sure hope so. Otherwise, what the hell is that? Trunk man's not there. Hello? The ringing stopped. And the lines are still dead. Well, that's odd. Alright. Back to sleep. Out. Out of this house. A nice smile you have. So pretty. Well, what is this? Does she? Does it want to open my window? Here. Stay away from this thing's arms. Yes. Oh, we're not sticking around for that. We really... Wait. Ah. Light is flickering. There's something inside the lamp. Well, can you get it? You should open it up. Yes, you should. I can't reach the lamp without something to stand on. Can we take a stool? This should help me reach. Yes, it should. Another one of these. A mysterious paper. The night is darkest before the dawn. End is near. For one beginning of the for one beginning of the end and for the other end of the beginning. One of whom is a reminder of hope, the other the lack thereof. Both are one and the same. They cannot coexist after the night. I wonder who's who. I'm definitely the hope. At least that's what I like to believe. Ava is the end of hope. Huh? 
Was that Eva knocking? I guess she wants to talk. Oh, yeah, there she is. Hello, Ava. Hello again. Hey, what's up? Not able to sleep? Huh, how come? You're making a lot of noise. He is going to come knocking. That would be the second time tonight. So what are you doing there? I don't know. I'm seeing weird things. Don't know if it's from the fact that I woke up so suddenly from sleep and now I'm still kind of dreaming or something's wrong with me. Okay, we need to get you out of there. You're starting to get cabin fever, huh? Also, did I hear a phone? You heard it too? Yeah, I thought I did. The lines are fixed now? Could be easier to... No, they're still dead. Well, then how did... So it's not just me. You spoke of those guys, the Lincoln Junkies? You said they did something upstairs? I mean, I'm not sure. I've seen some of their tags there. You've been up there? Yeah, I've been in the hallway. How isn't the gate locked? Uh, that was... That was back when there was no gate. Oh. Guess I could climb over it now. Really? It's pretty narrow. Are you saying I'm fat? No, it's just... I'm messing with you. Anyway. You thought I could resist the temptation to explore an ab abandoned floor right above me? So, what's it like up there? About what you'd expect. Same as this floor, but... Dustier and grimier and... Well, there were lots of those tags like I mentioned. Okay. Okay, well, I guess I'm going to jump over the gate. Wish me luck! Whoa, wait, you're going up there? Well, you clearly want me to. And I want to. And do what? Check that apartment. What above me? You think it's... You think it's not locked? I mean, I don't know. I'm gonna see if it is. I don't know about this. Imagine how pissed you'd be if we... Imagine how pissed you'd be we would be if that door was open all along. Imagine how pissed you'd be... Imagine how pissed you'd be we would be if that door was open all along. And we could've just kicked the damn thing blocking the door down. You don't want to find out? I guess, just... Let me find something that can break the lock instead. Oh, really? Isn't that worse? Yeah, but if you need to get out of there in a hurry, it's faster this way. I can keep guard and look at the gate while you're up there. What? How? I can see through a hole in the hallway. That's... creepy. Well, it's not like I'm seeing someone's room. <coughs> Still, I was wondering how you knew I was in trouble. Are you sure you're all good? I'm fine. I'm feeling much better now. Okay. I'm going to find something now. All right. I know just the thing. Come here, hammer and chisel. I've been waiting to pick you up all game. Ah, yes, these are from my workshop days. However short time that was. Used to do carving, little statues. I was never good at it, but I enjoyed it. People were friendly there. Kind of miss those days. Anyways, these could prove useful in my predicament. I got the chisel and hammer. I can do with just the hammer. You can keep the chisel. Alright. I have to throw the hammer to you since I can't slide this under the door. Okay, hold on. Alright, you ready? Bam! Good catch, Ava. There she goes. The brave, brave girl. All right. Now he said we creep through the hole in the storage closet. That's the sea. Go. All right. I'm sure we're going to need the chisel for something. Something terrible is going to happen. You just know it. It's only a matter of time. Did she get in? Oh, that was upstairs. 
Ava? Hey, Henry. The door was open? Nope. And how did you get in? I didn't hear you using the hammer. When I found the door, it was locked. Of course. So I, I used your key. I realized I still got them. Give it a try for the hell of it, and it actually worked. How's that possible? They probably use reuse the same lock. The floor has been vacant for a long time. Makes me wonder if there's a lock here that fits my key. Anyway, so we're here. Well, I'm here. Dusty and all, but this is surprising. This isn't. This isn't surprisingly good shape. And there's furniture. I have to take a few photos. You're not in a hurry, right? Yeah, make some more evidence of this crime. You took a camera with you? Of course. Okay, enough. Let's pull this thing down. Barely hanging from here. When I opened the door, it moved quite a lot. Let me get into place first. Alright, let's start moving. Okay, ready? Ready. Start stomping, or something. Yeah, I'll try not to fall down with it. It falls. Oh, there she is. Go, go, go. Oh, Ina man's not going to like this. Woo! We got it. We did. What in God's name is that racket? Ah, oh, crap. I'll handle him. You sure? Yeah, wait here. Okay, again, don't worry. We're so close. Block. Bill can't really move this out of the way. What's inside anyway? I can open it now. Huh? It doesn't open. Probably all rusted shut. I can pry this open though. Something. What about the chisel? Use chisel. Hang in there. That's the same poster we have in there. Take the rope. I think that's a noose. Hey, we're free. I think I could hoop the rope on that door handle above. And then climb up. That's the way I get out. Do it. Okay, here we go. Ugh. Climb, Henry, climb. Made it. It's really dark in here. Yeah, it's a little dark. Something's blocking the door from the other side. Yeah. Blocked from the other side. I smell something horrible coming from there. Whoa. Hello. Oh. Oh. Yes, hello. Who are you? A peeker. What? What are you peeking at? Notches. Love V? My turn. Who are you? How did you get here? I live in the apartment below this one. Climbed up through the hole. Huh? Hmm. You must be the... Must be what? Hmm. Nothing. There is some understanding of this force. It's been long before us. Force? What? Lovey. We know very little, but still more than most. Lovey, like Black Alley Strip Club or whatever? No. I believe in that context it means something else. So, just a coincidence. He knows us. We know him. We consist of people with very diverse backgrounds. You're one of those Lincoln Street junkies. That's a very condemning name. It's some of us. Ones who seek procure. And you... Peak? We're going in circles now. I've talked too much anyway. Please, what is this lovey? You must have noticed something. It's like a canvas. No, more like a... The residue is visible, but we haven't a clue what the filter is. And you call this residue lovey? Bingo. It's like a lingering dark cloud. Pitch black alley in a bright sunny town. I'm starting to get why you're ref referred to as junkies. Anyway, what exactly are you doing here? This place. We visit this place every now and then. It has definitely changed. It's been a while, though. It's no surprise it's up here. 
mind wanders and then wanders, especially during the night, and ascends perhaps. Lovey here. Then, a strange night. Your senses are compromised. Are you real? I don't know how to prove it definitively. Hmm. But, so there's a chance that there was no the notch. We're in the dark. All the same. Nothing has changed. Hmm? I'm off. Have fun peeking. Sure. The sun is rising. The dream fades. Dream? Might as well call it that. The residue. It's from the root of our minds. I'm serious. Have you taken something? No. Nothing. It would, that would hurt my peeking. Alright. Continue. Body eases its grip during the night. Ripe for pooling. That's what Witch Rock says. Witch Rock? Who's Witch Rock? Fellow peeker. I'll leave you alone now. I'll be gone in a few. I'm done here. What a nice little peeker. Have fun. This resembles my apartment, but the walls are wrinkled and faded, and the air is unnervingly still and stuffy. Although, all the windows are broken. Ugh. I feel like there's some cold metal ball rolling around inside my head. I feel not so good. I can't breathe. What is this place? Is this the way it's going to going to? This is my life? Might be, Henry. Might be. Something missing. Days are coming. A tag again. Ending one, Valvela. So, looks like you get this ending from uh, opening the window and letting that creature in. Um, and then you get to talk to the peeker. So, that was cool. And it invaded our computer and got inside our apartment. So, uh, that was cute. Uh, we're going to go back in, though, and try to get the other ending as well. Um, yeah, so we'll, we'll, we'll be back in a bit. Fine. Let's do something about you. I don't know what, but we're going to do something. Uh, camera! This is Ava's camera. I guess she left it in here. You can use the camera by holding control and take a photo by pressing the left mouse button. Awesome! It's paid off brain, baby! Let's go! Die, bitch! Where, where did it go? It's still around here somewhere. You're not lurking in the mirror! No, you're not. Okay. Is it invisible? Oh, God. Is it? I don't see it there. Aha! Ooh. Gotcha. Yeah. I don't see you here. Maybe you're in the bedroom window. 
Aha! What is it doing to me? I don't have much time. Are you in here? Uh, no. Here. Uh, gotta be quick. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Bedroom, bedroom, bedroom. Are you lurking? Ah, I see ya. Yeah! What? What? Did I... Did I do it? Did I get them all? I don't have a camera anymore. again um what's up taking a liking to my camera uh it it was great hey but this place it's you haven't even seen my apartment but whoa easy we're advancing a bit quick don't you think how about we go out and get something to eat fresh air alone is enough for me you done here? Ready to go? Um, yes. Let's go. You did it. Did what? You made it out. Well, I couldn't have done it by myself. No, it was all you. Trust me. You're happy, right? Yes? Then great. Let's go. Oh, and here are the keys, good sir. Hell, about time. Did we get the happy ending? Did we get the girl and the happy and good ending? And still hear that radio playing. Ah, it never shut off. Ruining the mood, it really is. Blank frame. That was a good game. That was a really good game. I like that. I think that there's only two endings. I'm not really sure. Honestly, I'm probably only going to get the just the two endings because you have to start the game completely over when you want to replay it. There's no save states or anything like that. Ending two, Yunira Farina. Fre Frenia? I'm not sure how you say that, but a game created by Through Tunnel. Yeah, uh, either way, it was a really good game. I thoroughly enjoyed that. Um, so yeah, if you like what you see, feel free to leave us a like. Hit that subscribe button if you don't mind and you like horror content. That's pretty much what we'll be playing moving forward. Um, if you have any other suggestions for games that you think would be great for our, me to play, let me know down below. Um, and as always, thank you so much for tuning in and watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. <laughs>